Definitely. Uh, it was a fast four years. Um, it was a really good four years for me. Um, I think after Sunday, you know, we we're going to work our way to have many more games after that. But, um, you know, I'm definitely going to enjoy Sunday a lot. Yes. And then you worked your way into the starting line of the shooting guard because they couldn't get you off the floor. Is that kind of what happened when you started here? Uh, yeah, if you want to put it that way. Um, you know, Trey and I, we were out there a lot together. Um, so I had a chance to, you know, learn on the fly from him. And, um, you know, obviously he had, he had a really good career here. So um, as soon as I got on campus, he was teaching me. Uh, the ins and outs of the college game. And uh, I really benefited a lot being around him on a day-to-day -day basis. Now, did you take that cue from him to teach the younger people that came in behind you and the that you played? Yes, definitely. Um, um, and even at practice now, Trey's still there teaching me. So um, it's good to have guys like him around our program. And um, um, the effect that he had on me, hopefully I had a, that same effect on the younger guys. James, you uh, said you know, you'd like to try and have as many games as possible. Obviously, you being a senior, is there a little more sense of urgency even than you had like last year to try to make sure you win a couple of games here and get to the NCAA tournament since it's your last year? Um, definitely. I think the goal always is to go to the NCAA tournament. But, um, you know, this year I think we have a special group of guys. I think once we do, once we do get into the NCAA tournament, we can really make some noise. Um, we had good practice today. And um going to have another good one tomorrow in preparation for Sunday. But um, as a senior, you definitely want to, you know, play forever. So, you know, that's definitely what I want to do too. You, we played a couple of years ago when you guys played Colorado. And, you know, have you talked to some of the guys that haven't been, some of the younger guys maybe that haven't been to the NCAA tournament just about what that experience is like yet? I mean, is that something you've kind of shared with them? This is why it's special or this is why you like it so much? Well, yes, definitely. Just, you know, I mean, it's the NCAA tournament. You grow up watching it as a kid, and then when you put yourself into the position where you can be a part of it, um, it's a definitely a great feeling. But um, not just the younger guys, but we have three, um, you know, senior transfers that are that haven't been a part of the tournament as well. And um, you know, we're all hungry to to get to the tournament this year. Um, I wish it was that easy just to point to one thing, but, um, you know, I think it just comes down to each, each person, um, you know, just buying in and getting, you know, believing that we're going to get that stop. Um, after they hit three or four, we had to believe on that fifth possession. All right, this is, this is enough. We're getting a stop right here. And, um, you know, we weren't able to do that, but, um, it's definitely something we can learn from. And, uh, we're going to be in that situation again where we are going to have to buckle down and get the stop, and we still have to have confidence in ourselves as a team that, you know, we, we can do it. Do you think because you have done it at times, you, you've done it, even in that game, like I said, the first 11 minutes of the half, you know, and then what they have, like six points maybe in the first 11 minutes of the half, have you, have, I mean, is that help that you have done it as a team, or does it make it even more frustrating when you don't get it done? It makes it frustrating um, knowing that we have – we're more than capable of getting the job done, but um, I think there still is a confidence level that, okay, we're, you know, we're going to put this whole thing together for 40 minutes and, um, you know, really get the job done against a good team. So uh, the Louisville game is, you know, behind us now. We have another good opportunity to play a complete 40 minutes on Sunday. Yes, definitely. Um, you know, we practice today was – you know, strictly in preparation for them. And uh, we know, you know, they have a lot of skilled guys. You know, they're going to dribble, drive, um, you know, 
kick it out for open shooters. And um, you know, it's going to come down to our defense. Um, um, you know, we're going to be ready to play 40 minutes of defense. What do you think you're going to be thinking just stepping on the court and kind of like maybe going through your mind? Winning. That's it. Like, it's senior night, and, you know, I know, you know, my family will be here, and, you know, that would be enjoyable for them. I'll, I'll enjoy it too, but, um, you know, the feelings would be that much better, you know, with a win. Not too much. Um, you know, I think obviously, you know, before the game, they're going to do the, you know, ceremony and things like that. And um, I'll enjoy it. You know, my family will be here. And, um, it'll be a really good time. But in terms of, you know, realizing that, okay, it's time to play the game now, I think I'll, um, me as, as well as the other seniors will be ready to go. Um, yeah, that's that's a pretty cool stat. Um, <laughs> I didn't I didn't know that, but you know that you know that definitely means a lot to me. But because um, I know there's been a lot of really good players that come through here, so um, you know I guess that that that, that definitely means a lot to me, and um, you know I'm proud to say that. Um, he's definitely going to be attacking, you know, for 40 minutes. Um, you know, he's obviously a really good shooter, but, you know, when he when he drives the ball, he can, you know, use his body to, you know, knock the defender off balance and then finish. But, um, you know, we're just going to have to be ready to play. Um, he's not the only guy they have. They're across the board. They're talented, and uh, we'll be ready to go. I think we'll we'll pretty much stick to our game. Um, you know, we just want to take the first open shot. Um, you know, make sure the ball is moving around. But I think that's something we want to do going into every game. Um, you know, they're a good offensive team, so what better opportunity for us to prove our defense? So I think that's going to be our thing going into Sunday's game is uh, really being solid on the defensive end.